Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now in today's video, we're going to be bringing you a brand new Jade Protocol update. Now, in my last Jade Protocol video, you guys saw and I mentioned that I won't be doing daily updates on this thing anymore. Um, and that is the case. I'm not going to be doing daily updates on Jade. I'm going to be updating it every now and then when there's new info and when I feel like doing an update, right? So we're going to be doing one today. Um, in terms of what's happened over the past few days and that good stuff So if you're excited make sure you drop a like subscribe down below if you're new and turn the notifications on so you don't miss a future video Also, if you are looking for any free money check out the link down below to Celsius currently They're giving $50 for completely free when signing up with my link and referral code and depositing some Bitcoin You'll get $50 for completely free so check that out again link down below But without any further ado, let's jump into it. So if you guys don't know or you're in Jade, you're not in Jade, you don't know, pretty much they've changed up their entire model to pretty much be a decentralized VC fund where, well, actually they haven't changed it because they did actually mention initially that they were going to be a decentralized VC fund. But as soon as they've done it, obviously people were a bit, uh, not not skeptical, curious, but just a bit sort of um, weirded out that there's no um, uh, APY anymore. Well, they did mention in their initial video on the website that things will be that it will be a decentralized vc fund i just don't think that people um you know really understood what they were doing and they just done it one day which is fair enough a little bit, a bit of warning would be nice but uh it is what it is so um yeah jade's wall path to a thousand dollar floor price i made a video on this going over the complete sort of uh medium article that they did release on it so if you guys haven't seen that, then I'd recommend going to check it out um, because, yeah, I'd recommend going to check it out. It was like a 30 minute video going over the entire document and sort of reading it out and, and going over it and explaining my thoughts on it pretty much. So go and check that out if you haven't already. But um, yeah, so J Protocol then. Let's go ahead and have a look at their Twitter. Guys, go and follow me on Twitter. I'm trying to hit 4K, oh sorry, 5K followers on here, getting closer and closer to that. So Jade Protocol's Twitter here, they haven't tweeted up too much. I mean, they responded, they tweeted out this two days ago saying, 2,000 quiz response is only five quid. Bottom line, Jade has the treasury and community to attract the best unicorns and no other VC fund can say that. $3,000 awarded to the five below for acting the, uh, for acing the test. Congrats to these people. Um, and they, you know, won some, won some money or, or won a giveaway of, of some sort. So pretty cool stuff. But other than that, not too much really in terms of Jade News on their Twitter account. However, there's one guy that kind of controls a lot of the community stuff. Um, by the way, I'm not paid by Jade or anything. This is, I'm just personally invested in Jade, so I'm doing updates on it. Um, and I have been since day one invested. So John Ray is the community liaison officer or the guy, yeah, the community guy pretty much, the community manager for Jade Protocol and for SmartCoin. So in terms of what they've done now, he tweets out pretty often, okay, he's got 11.1K tweets. Um, yeah, he's got 11.1K tweets. So, you know, it's, uh, he does a lot of AMAs. Now, he just done a recent AMA here in terms of Jade and DCAing. Now it is over an hour long, an hour and 20 minutes long, so it's a pretty, it could be a pretty good watch. I personally haven't seen this yet, but it is over an hour, nearly an hour and a half long in terms of an update. Uh, DCA and speculating cir uh, effective circulating supply plus Jan for AMA Jade protocol. So pretty interesting stuff. I'd recommend going and check that out if you want some more information about DCAing and, and pretty much how they're making profit right now. Um, but so in terms of J price, we're currently set at 35.97. Fair market value is currently set at 201 dollars and 77 cents, with a floor price of 18 dollars 63 cents, with a growth of 19.9 percent. Now the good thing is, is that this floor price is growing, which means that this can't go below that. So, you know, if we want to set some buy orders in for the floor price, it could be a good way to make some money because how it can't go below this floor price is pretty much Jade have. Uh, introduced a they've introduced a bot or create a bot so that if the price of J does go to this or below it the bot will automatically buy back the tokens which is cool so in terms of in the price if we have a look at the price here you can see that we did have this pretty big rally up here to about $71 when the news first came out um, and then since then it's dropped all the way down to about $36 again so a lot of the hype um, for this has died off now if we have a look at J protocol the price you can see that the price again isn't hanging up too well I mean it's at $36 which is up 2% for the day and in terms of price we started at 35 went down to about 
34.74 and then spiked up to $38 again and we can see that on uh, Dex Greener where we actually did go up to about $39 um, and again we did go up to about 39 bucks over the past sort of couple of days um, but then it just came right back down again to 36 so I don't know maybe someone was trading it maybe some whale dumped and made some profit and dumped who knows but um this is good that the floor price is going up and this is going to go up for the next couple of days now what's interesting is that on the 7th of January excuse me on the 7th of January they're going to stop putting money into the floor contract or sorry the the buyback contract right and the floor price so after that point the floor price uh, is going to be determined by the market and not you know inflated by jade anymore so that's going to be interesting to see how things actually happen um i think it's good yeah on the 7th of jan it's going to be interesting also one thing to mention is that they are releasing their new um they are releasing their second part of their roadmap where they're going to be announcing the new key hires the the, the DeFi, um the DeFi guys that they've hired the yield farmers that they've hired and stuff to help make profit in the vc fund um so it's going to be interesting to see that happen you know as and when that comes out i think they're going to pretty much announce a lot more in terms of this um these four different components i'm personally interested in this yield farming um component also the thousand x investments are going to be pretty interesting i guess the trading decks and bonding are both pretty interesting as well but i'm personally mostly interested in how they're going to be doing their yield farming because there's a lot of uh, opportunity to be made there and we just hold the jade token and as, as they earn profits you know that goes back into jade and and that should put the put the price up so it could be pretty interesting there but um yeah in terms of staking there's not no real benefit of staking jade i don't believe don't quote me on that but i don't believe that there's currently too much benefit in staking jade anymore considering there's no apy so you guys can go ahead and unstake your jade if you want to i'm just going to keep it in there it was worth uh, 500 when i first put it in now with 87 look it is what it is. It's okay. I, I don't mind too much because I like, I, I'd i prefer it if it was a DAO and it was still pumping out the APY. But I think the decentralized VC fund that they've got going on is interesting. Um, and it's going to be a good one. And I, I, I kind of like the fact that they're going down this route. Now, it's not the best route to go down, but I do like it. And I think it's going to be interesting to see how this does play out long term. But currently worth $87 from 500 so we're down quite a bit there. Now, the percentage of Jade staked is actually coming down. Um, so 73.9, it's still 74% of Jade tokens are staked in here. So it looks like people are doing the same thing as me. Look, I'm, I'm not worried about it, to be honest. I'm just let, leaving it in here and seeing what it does over time. That's what I'm personally doing. And I, I think a lot of people are doing something very similar. Um, so yeah, you know, it, it makes sense that there's still 74% of Jade tokens still staked in here. Fair market value is two hundred and one dollars, and the price is thirty five ninety eight. So just a quick little update here, guys. I'd recommend going and checking out John Ray's Twitter um, because again, he's the community liaison guy for Jade and Smart Coin. So um, yeah, pretty pretty good stuff there, and and you can you know sort of see how things are things are happening, um, what things are doing, and sort of the stuff that he's replying to people with and, and updates and stuff. So pretty pretty cool account there if you're interested in jade or you're invested in jade then john ray is probably a good person to check out on twitter but guys that's gonna be it for this video if you haven't enjoyed make sure you smash a like subscribe down below go follow me over on twitter currently doing a giveaway for a free lifetime access spot in the premium discord server which is releasing either today or tomorrow so if this is still up then congratulations you can still enter if not then the group is now live and you can go and check that out there's a link down below in the description to the group if it is live by the time you're watching this video but guys thanks for watching Hope you enjoyed, have a great day, and I'll see you on my next video. Peace.